I, and I think it's more prevalent with, with people around the world, like Kundalini awakenings, things like that. Just like overall people talk about, you know, spiritual awakening and stuff like that. It just right now on this on planet, it seems like it's just happening more and more and, and, and more stuff's going on. And, you know, there's all the ancient prophecies, the Mayans, the astrology, all these things saying that we're going into this new age, you know, the second coming of Christ, just, you know, being just an awakening really uh, of all of us, you know, Hopi prophecies, they're all talking about um, this, you know, thousands of years of peace and, and things like that, um, that are occurring at, at this time point. And I think it's, you know, us transforming people talk about going from 3D to 5D. Um, but then there's the procession of the equinoxes and the different yuga stages where you have the, the darkness and you come into the light phases that last a couple thousand years. You know, all this stuff is is very cosmically tied in and People talk about solar flares and pole shifts and alignment of the Earth's energy grids and collapsing of our financial system and the matrix that we live in and all that stuff. It's like this awakening and spiritual actuation um, that I think is happening all over. Just <sighs> and, I, and I think it's because, yeah, because we're our planet, our, if you think of that as the great year, the great cycle that we we're talking, the procession of equinox, we are going into, we, you have to remember, we're spinning around this, you know, this fireball and that's like being whirled around you know like a galaxy that is still moving within the universe like all of this is in motion so we're moving into other parts of our galaxy and within the universe itself that's causing these shifts to happen like yeah they say our galaxy is moving into uh, uh, just this big photon energy field um, within the universe that is just activating all this stuff and i mean all these things all this historical ancient stuff and, and what people are, are scientifically discovering is happening is it all just a coincidence or is you know there's something behind that i think i think yeah and and, and after doing I and mean, after my experience it was like well that was the validation i guess i was really looking for if i needed to really know am i on the right path am i looking am i look asking the right questions am i getting the answers and and making sense of it well that was kind of my answer there and to say look you're it, it just keep going like you know this is a little nudge to say you know don't don't stop doing what you're doing it's 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 probably you know it's i think it means i'm doing something right and yeah hopefully if i'm searching if i'm true to myself and i'm searching for answers then i think you ultimately you find you find what you're looking for and you you get the guidance even the higher the guidance from uh, other beings other even your higher self is is, right. is guiding you along the way 